even ask how many robes, kimonos do I have? And my response to that is a lot. Morning. Sharon here, A Dress Restyling. Thank you for joining me for another Let's Get Dressed. Where we do what? Wear and style or clothes in our closet for 2023. No shopping for 2023. Well, this is going to be a little bit different get, Let's Get Dressed video because it's going to be kind of a twofer. I have been asked how many robes, kimonos do I have? And my response to that is a lot because as you can see, I have a lot here. But there's a reason for that and there's justification and I was also asked to share some of them so let's go let me go ahead and get dressed um, if I didn't say it, I am working from home today so it's gonna be very casual but I do have to run out I have an appointment today that's the reason I'm working from home so I do have to run out for an appointment and for that when I'm working from home I like to be comfortable and these little dresses the copy of the skins, mine came from Shein. I, I ordered every color. I think I have three black. Not, not I think, I know I have three black because I, the black color is a rotation for me because it, it, I could put the black on, throw something on and go, I'm out the door. So let me go ahead and put this on and be right back. <laughs> okay, so I have my comfy skims copy on from Shein. And like I said, when I'm in the house, this is perfect this is all I need it's loose it's comfortable and I still look presentable I still look put together however I do have an appointment I do have some errands that I have to run today now for my explanation as to why I have so many robes kimono and the reason for that is they're actually dual purpose let me show you for example this robe I can put a dress like this on and throw this on, put my heels on, and it changes the look. That's the reason why I have so many robes. I love wearing them not only as their intended purpose, as robes house robes but as cover-up as a matter of fact where is it this one I wore as a beach cover-up I had a bathing suit on and this was my beach cover-up I love them and I love, you know, using them as dual purpose. And every single one of these, every single one of these are thrifted. Let me show you. Um, well, no, that's not true. Wait a minute. Hold on. These are not thrifted. Let me show you the ones that are not thrifted. This. Yeah, these are not thrifted. I actually... <laughs> purchased these from Gambia when I went to Africa <laughs> and you won't believe how much they were like six US I love them <laughs> I wore these when I went to Aruba as my beach cover-up I had my um, bathing suit on and this was my beach cover-up doesn't it make a statement you know, Sharon likes to make a statement, whether she's on the beach or not. <laughs> so this was my beach cover-up when I went to Aruba. And I love it. So these are the only ones that are not thrifted. And I purchased them, like I said, when I went to Gambia and um, at a market. I love an African market. And this one, thrifted, purchased this one from good well it's more of a kimono I love to wear like an all-white some um, jeans 
with a little bit of distressing in it with a white tank top and this perfect so I hope this kind of explains <laughs> why I have so many of these and that's because I just don't use them you know as rules now the, granted there are some that can only be robes like for instance this one you know it's it's obviously a robe and let's see this one is not obviously a robe because of the animal print if I was wearing a shorter dress I would most definitely sleeveless what am I I'm getting tangled up here <laughs> sleeveless I would most definitely throw this on over it dual purpose but it's it's a robe and most of these are silk 100% silk so I went through a time when I just thrifted silk robes because you know nothing feels good on the body like silk <laughs> yes I'm I get asked a lot of questions about this one and I love robes with like um, oriental motif on them I think they're so much more interesting maybe because it makes me think that I'm in the Orient and I'm unfortunately I have not been to Asia yet but it's on my list to visit but it's gonna be a minute <laughs> because of everything that's happening Current, currently one of my most favorite one where are you where are you oh yeah this one I love this one absolutely love it look at this isn't it stunning isn't this just stunning I love it and I thrifted this one for $25 when I was in Portugal in Lisbon because you know when I when I travel I still thrift it's like we look I'm trying to find where where are the thrift stores where are the consignment shops I thrifted this one in Portugal for $25 tell me this is not stunning it's everything I actually got two of them so I got this one and let's see where's the other one where are you where are you <laughs> oh yeah this one so this this one is the other one I got in Portugal I love the lavender that peeks out from the gray and white isn't this stunning isn't this just stunning and you just throw this on over a dress put your heels on some accessories and you're ready to go <laughs> this one that i'm going to show you is very special because we were in hilton head i love going to hilton head great thrifting there too we're going i think in june we're going to hilton head i think in june unfortunately i can't thrift because you know i'm not shopping this year <laughs> so they're going to go shopping and i'll just sit my little butt on the beach but this one thrifted while on vacation in hilton head and i saw it it's a hundred percent silk kimono fell in love with it isn't it stunning but it was kind of pricey it was well worth it but I wasn't willing to spend it but this is a hundred percent silk kimono and she was asking either 60 or 80 I don't quite remember I want to say 60 but it could have been 80 and she wouldn't budge she would not budge the price that she had on there was the price she wanted but I'm like, no, I don't want to spend that much money. But it's well worth it. It was well worth it. 
because it's a hundred percent silk like I said and it, it's stunning you know I have some amazing sisters I've talked about my sisters and my sissy said my sissy P said do you want it I said yes but I'm not going to pay I can't remember 80 or 60 I'm not paying that much for it <laughs> and she said do you want it and I said yeah but I'm not paying for it she said I'll get it for you and I looked at her I'm like why <laughs> she said because you want it so this was from my sissy <laughs> my sister <laughs> and I love it so this this is the story behind my kimonos my robes and so forth and why I have so many of them I totally enjoy wearing them now let me see which one am I gonna throw over this black dress and wear it today oh look at this one look at the print on this one oh, I usually wear this one as a beach cover-up too now I'm not this is a little bit too much for today <laughs> I still want to be understated somewhat as understated as Sharon can be Oh, look at this one. I use this one a lot as a beach cover. Isn't it stunning? Let me pull this one up. Isn't it stunning? Oh, look at it. Isn't it stunning? <laughs> All right, but we're not wearing this one today. I am having too much fun with this. Okay. Let me see which one am I going to throw over this dress. I want one oops, that's as long, that is as long as the dress. Because when I'm wearing long dresses, I like the kimono to be as long as the dress. And I think, I think I found one. Let's see. You know, this will look, this will work, but I think this will look better if I had my brown dress on. Hold on, let me grab my brown dress. Let's see, where is that thing here? Cause you know, like I said, I have this in, <laughs> in all the colors. Yeah, okay. So I'm gonna do a quick change, throw this brown one on and be right back. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> one of these days I'm not gonna fall. Okay, so I, I threw the brown one on. And now let's see how it looks with this. Perfect. Yep. So this will be my look for today. <laughs> and when I'm leaving, when I'm ready to go, I'm going to add my brown sandals. If you watch my closet video, you know my brown <laughs> shoes are in here. So let me get my whoop, brown sandal. Sandals, where are you? Okay, cool. I found this one. It's a Zara sandals. I've never worn. Let's see if I like it with this dress. This is not the one I was going for, but let's see. I don't like it with this. It's a little too clunky for this, but maybe something else. Let's see. you guys sit there while I try and find my brown sandals that I have in mind to wear I'll be right back boy that was a feat <laughs> it was all the way at the bottom and there are stacks I had to go one by one oh gosh anyhow <laughs> so these are I'm sweating Whew. is that a hot flash gosh anyhow 
So these are the sandals that I'm going to wear today. My Steve Madden. And I think they'll be perfect with this dress. I think I've actually worn this like this before. But with another robe. I have to stand underneath the fan. Let me tell you guys. These hot flashes, they're kicking my butt. I don't know what's going on. Why they're coming back all of a sudden like this. But something needs to be done. Okay. But anyhow, so when I'm getting ready to leave the house, after I cool down, this will be my look. Um, I didn't bring a bag in. But I think I'm going to just do one of my neutral color bag. Like one of the, my raffia bags. Because I'm feeling kind of springy today. So, while I'm lounging around in the house, I will not have my heels on. But when I'm ready to go, this will be the look with my raffia bag. Thank you, thank you, thank you for joining me and spending a couple minutes with me. <laughs> as I share with you my robe collection as requested. My subscribers, you are appreciated. Thank you so much. If you've not subscribed to my channel, please consider subscribing. I would really, really appreciate your, th your support. Thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs up. As I sweat, oh my gosh, it is, wow, I'm burning up. <laughs> oh goodness. Anyhow, remember to thumbs up, comment, and share. Find a reason to smile even when you're having a hot flash. Find a reason to smile because I'm having a hot flash. That means I'm alive. <laughs> Until the next Let's Get Dressed or whatever video, this is Sharon saying bye-bye. <laughs>